Good morning, everyone. Crazy Dom here, and I've completed a 4th of July weekend of Birmingham, Alabama. Uh, first things first, uh, going into Bama, uh, when I tell people that I'm going to, um, excuse me, to Alabama, uh, basically people would joke around and say, Bama, you're going to Alabama, Dom? Let me just be very clear. Alabama people do have an accent, but they do not sound like that, okay? So, uh, that out of the way. Um, Birmingham, Alabama. It was, so far, very, very laid back. Like this. Hear how I'm sounding. It's very laid back there. It's very laid back. Like... You could almost sleep while you walk around and do things. It's that relaxing. Uh, known for, <clears throat> uh, you know, special history. Um, sometimes unfortunate history, but it does show the history of the state. Um, basically the civil rights movement and um, the women's movement. Um, it's got science fairs, museums, uh, you saw my videos of the zoo, it's a beautiful zoo, um, it also had live shows, I wasn't there for the live shows, I could not record everything, and that's another thing about Al uh, Birmingham, Birmingham is huge, it's huge, I could not possibly have the battery to record everything, um, so whatever I didn't record, I'm sorry, but to give you an overall aspect of Birmingham, just know that it's a very, very relaxing place to be. Very relaxing. You know, it's like watching uh, Bob Ross, you know, the painter. Let me get some titanium white and mix it with charcoal brown. And we'll put a little happy tree right there. Like, it's that relaxing. Now, I'm sure there's gonna be other states that are just as laid back but so far this was the most laid back place i've been to um and that could also be its bigness biggest weakness um coming from the new york city long island area i was not used to this type of laid back like even the spots that had some pop to it it was just so chill there um but in a way it's a better opportunity to meet people because not everyone's hustling and bustling you know, um, it's known for, it's more of its suburban life, the downtown area, it's not that big. Um, and the Lakeview area, things to do there are not that big either. Um, but it's more for its suburban life. So far, the best barbecued food I've ever had. The sushi's good, but eat their barbecue food. Um, I, they just cook it amazing down here. Um, so is Birmingham worth the visit? Yeah, I would say it's worth the visit. Uh, visit. Um, you know, it does get very hot and humid towards the summer. Uh, some of my videos, you heard me <sighs> while I was talking. Not that I was super out of shape, but because it was just that humid down here. So the air was a very, very, very thick. Um, you know, and just like Texas, I just wondered how did people survive here before air conditioning but that's just my opinion but yeah visit Birmingham it's if you want a relaxing weekend where you can go out and do things and you can just soothe your soul you know I mean they look they, they, there are live bands that happen in uh, mini concerts that draw some crowds but um, it, it's it's very 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 laid back here in Birmingham so if you want a very smooth weekend to come visit you can come to Birmingham great zoo great um, friendly people um, great suburban life not too much of a city life but you know again it's just a relaxing environment so Birmingham Alabama 